For question number four, <clears throat> uh, we would like to find the speed of a particle at time t equals two, and we know the rates in the x direction and the y direction as it changes over time. So essentially, uh, this is just going to be like Pythagorean theorem. We're going to take the square root of each of those squared. So the derivative of t of x with respect to t, the derivative of y with respect to t, each one squared and added together. But we specifically are interested at t equals 2. And they already gave us um, the derivatives. So just need to plug in a 2 into this to know the rate of change of x at time t equals 2. And plug in 2 into this to know the rate of change in the y direction in time by plugging in 2 for t. And then I just threw all this in my calculator. Wait, well, of course I just plugged in the numbers. Plugged in the um, derivatives where they're supposed to go. And I threw all that in my calculator, rounded to the nearest three decimal places like the AP exam expects, and came out with an answer of 2.121.